Thursday, February the 6th, President Trump stands at the peak of his power. One hour from now, he will do a victory lap. He will celebrate, and so he should. Nancy Pelosi, the squad, and the rest of the livid left threw everything at him and lost. He won the ridiculous impeachment fight. It's over. What a waste of time. Pelosi, Schumer, Schiff, Nadler, what did these paragons of constitutional virtue achieve? Nothing. They just slimed the president and they slimed America. The president won on the economy. His tax cuts have given us prosperity. Tuesday night, he laid out the ever-growing list of economic successes, and the Democrats sat on their hands. Record low unemployment for minorities, record employment for women, they stayed seated, looking glum. In the face of prosperity, they want a huge tax increase on the economy. He's won, hands down. The president has won on immigration. He's cut the flow of illegals. The wall is being built. We are getting a handle on a problem that's been abound and around for two generations. And the Democrats? They're actually going into this election demanding open borders, abolish ICE, and let's give illegals free health care. Cue the eye roll. But most important of all, this president has beaten back the hate mongers. I understand they're not going away. Of course not. But he's clearly shown that a political party that's motivated by hate will lose. That's all they had. The enduring image will be Speaker Pelosi, contemptuously ripping up long list of the president's successes. And that's where we stand this morning. The president rides high.